what's up Laws and Monster fans, this is Zach, and I'm finally getting to do a controller review that I have wanted to do for a very long time, and a review that a lot of people have been asking for and been very excited about. Uh, there are three things uh, that's going to be in, in this video that I know a lot of people are going to be uh, very excited about, and you may be looking at it right now and thinking, you know, it's just a standard Xbox One controller, what's, what's so special about it? But it's what's actually the performance wise of this controller is why we're making this video. And the, th the three things that we're, we've got special on this controller are number one, new thumbsticks. Number two, adjustable trigger stops. And number three is a 10 mode rapid fire uh, with a lot of new features. And some people may uh, get upset, uh, say this, that, and the other, oh, you're running the game, but just try to hear me out. Um, I'm going to do the rapid fire at the end of the video, so if you're not into that thing, you can stop watching uh, after we get through with the thumbsticks and the trigger stops. Uh, but it, it's you know it's what we've done. It's we're laws of mods, M O D Z. We we do everything uh, that can be done to custom controllers. Um, we started this back in 2007. This was a big part of our business, and we you know we're going to keep continuing uh, with that. Uh, it's 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 sort of. It's not because, you know, we're trying to run a game, and actually it's very far from. We're trying to make everybody competitive on the same level. Uh, we're not doing anything that can't be achieved uh, regularly in game. So just to make sure that everybody's crystal clear, we're not doing anything that can't be achieved achieved in game by, uh, you know, just using your hands. So, uh, like I said, if you're not into that thing, you don't have to watch the end of the video. Uh, I'll, I'll let you know, and you can just stop there. You don't have to leave a negative comment. You don't have to say anything negative about it, but it's it's just from a business po point of view, it's smart for us to include our rapid fire that has been so very popular for many years uh, in our business model. So that, that's what we're going to do. So let's go ahead and take a look at this controller. Now that I've got that terribly long intro out of the way, uh, first of all, let's talk about these thumbsticks. I absolutely despise the Xbox One thumbsticks. They could quite possibly be the worst thumbstick that has ever been created. And that's, you know, that's a statement. It's 2014. It seems like we're going backwards instead of going forwards. Uh, you know, I remember using the, uh, you know, the, the Nintendo 64, the single thumbstick in the center. It is better than the Xbox One stick uh, that I've got right here. Uh, it's, it's, it's very small. It's got those little ridges or knobs on the side. And this little valley cup, whatever, that just keeps collecting dirt and everything that's on your hands, it just gets caught in that little ring and it's rough. I just, uh, I despised this thumbstick, hated it, and we tried our very hardest to get new thumbsticks uh, that's a our quality, not just the quality, but our quality. Guys, we're, we're, we are the standard when it comes to custom controllers. Uh, we've been around longer, a whole lot longer than all these other companies online. And, you know, we're, we're still around. We're still making videos still uh, as popular as ever. But what we've got on this Xbox One controller for the thumbsticks is, as you can see, they are domed instead of that terrible ridge, knobbed, cupped, dirt collecting piece of junk that comes on them. And you may be saying, well, that's just regular uh, PlayStation thumbsticks. And I can actually assure you that it's not. Uh, these are actually molded in-house. Everything we do, we have complete quality control over. Uh, the PlayStation 3 thumbstick is actually way too big to even fit inside of uh, the controller, so it doesn't fit at all. And just to sort of back up my claim, I do want to show you, uh, the, the, I guess, the first process that we go through um, here in-house to make these thumbsticks. This is the topper to the thumbstick that we use. And uh, we have a lot of different processes, a lot of uh, expensive equipment that we've had to purchase over uh, just the, the last couple of weeks to get a, uh, a, a, we call it a thermal weld to the right th uh, thumbsticks that work with the Xbox One. So this is the type of rubber that is on the top and then uh, the hard plastic that is underneath on the controller. But these thumbsticks are tremendously better than uh, th those terrible Xbox One thumbsticks that come on it. Your thumbs can roll on these. Uh, you, you just have a greater range of movement. The, the shaft that's on the inside part that holds the, uh, you know, the flat part of the thumbstick is actually smaller. So you get a whole lot more of a turn radius. And as you can see here, 
me see if I can get it in focus there. Maybe. Okay. The right thumbstick we have actually increased the size of. So uh, we have to be very careful when we install these thumbsticks that the right stick, the aiming stick, is actually a little bit higher. And the reason for that is to uh, get a better accuracy when you're playing, especially first person shooters. Uh, the more height that you create, it uh, actually it's, it works just like a lever. So the fulcrum uh, of, of movement is not just down low right where you're actually trying to get the movement out of, but if you extend it up and add just a little bit more height, the least little bit of movement is a whole lot more controllable, a whole lot more accurate, and you can play on a higher sensitivity. So the right stick will be just a little bit higher than the left stick, and uh, you know the, these work tremendously. They're just so awesome. I can't wait until uh, somebody can actually get a hold of a pair of these uh, on, on one of our controllers and actually use them. And I'm, I, I can guarantee you guys, they are a million times better than the Xbox One thumbstick that comes on the regular controller. Now, the second part of this uh, awesome video is adjustable trigger stops. So as you can see right here, the triggers only pull so far, and you can actually adjust that depending on the game you play. You may need a little bit further trigger pull. Um, you may want it a little bit shorter. It's completely up to you. Uh, we're going to include a little wrench here that just slides into this screw, and you can either you know lift to loosen it, and it'll give you a little bit more pull. Let me show you here. A couple pulls there. You can see how much farther this trigger now pulls than this one. And that's completely adjustable. You can back them all the way out, uh, and you can, you know, you will just have a regular fun functioning controller just like it comes out of the box. So, guys, that pretty much completes that part of the video. I'll go ahead and do my ending sort of right now. Uh, if you are interested in these two options, please check us out online at lazamods.com, L A Z A M O D Z dot C O M. Uh, you can also give us a call. We can have a, a real person, and that's very important, guys. Our customer service is par none the absolute best in the industry you can give us a call at any time we'll uh, have, have an answer for you have somebody to talk to you live on the phone no email no 36 hours 48 hours two weeks to answer you can call us and talk to us instantly uh, even on our emails we're pretty quick about those you know first couple hours that they're in we normally send you a reply back uh, but if you have any questions, that 800 number is 1-888-990-MODZ. That's 6639 on the end. And uh, you can ask about any of these if you have any questions, and we'll be happy to answer them. So now we'll go ahead and get back into uh, the, the last part of this video, which is our 10 mode rapid fire. And uh, like I said before, guys, if you are watching the video, you are curious. Um, this rapid fire, it's basically the same thing that we've been doing for you know since 2007 with our uh, seven mode rapid fire that's been tremendously popular uh, that we, we create here in-house install in-house everything here is made by us and we put it in the controller uh, ourselves so everything here has top top quality control um, this rapid fire is our 10 mode and that's what I'm pretty sure that we're going to keep our standard is our 10 mode we may increase to a 20 eventually uh, like we did with the Xbox 360 but this inside here is a 10 mode rapid fire and it pretty much has all the bells and whistles that you could want uh, when you turn the controller on it will flash you know just like normal and now uh, you know you, you can see there's no other extra buttons nothing like that on the uh, back of the controller or anything like that um, to enter rapid fire all you have to do is press the left directional pad. Press it twice and you're ready to go. Press it again and it turns off. Uh, it has 10 different sets and different speeds of rapid fire, so you can pick the, the, your favorite just like before. Uh, but we also included a lot of extra features. Um, just some of those to name a few is an auto run, so you don't have to keep pressing on the left stick to, you know, to run, it just automatically runs for you. Uh, we've got quick scopes, we have got auto spots for Battlefield 4, uh, drop shot, jump shot, uh, quick reloads, uh, jitter. There is just endless amounts uh, that you can do with this controller. We even have a sniper breath mode, so that way you don't have to hold, uh, I think it's the, the left thumbstick, uh, when you go into um, uh, your uh, scope, scoped in view with a sniper rifle. Um, you don't have to click that 
thumbstick anymore. All you have to do is scope in and it holds the breath for you. So there, there's a lot of exclusive features that only is going to be available on our controllers. Um, of course it comes with full instructions and uh, I'll go ahead and do a demo of this eventually in another video. But if you have any questions, like I said, please give us a call. We can explain it to you over the phone. And uh, until I can get that demo made, edited, and put back up on YouTube, um, you know that's how you can take care of it. You can just email us. We can give you a full spec sheet on everything that it does, everything it's uh, compatible with, how it works, everything like that, um, until I can get that video made. But guys, if you have any questions about anything that I covered, please leave us a comment below. Let us know uh, what you think. And also, something to mention, if you just order our standard controller from us, it will come with this LZM logo in the middle. So uh, that way, you know, if you have two controllers, you didn't want one painted, uh, you know, if you've got two of the stock controllers, you will know which one does have, you know, the, the special features that you pick, whether it's rapid fire, or the special thumbsticks, or uh, the adjustable triggers. Uh, it will come with that logo there in the center. But if you have any questions, please give us a call. Our number is 1-888-990-6639. Uh, you can also check us out Twitter, Facebook, uh, dot com slash lazamods l a z a m o d z um, definitely subscribe to us here on YouTube give us a like help us spread the word uh, there's a lot of people been asking for this and you know whether uh, whether you're a fan or not uh, of, of rapid fire you know it is what it is it's just another competitive way uh, for people that maybe not don't don't have as much time to get good on the game uh, to to still be competitive you know the gaming's about having fun it's not necessarily about you know paychecks and uh, how much money you can make, or you know, uh, legal, official, this, that, and the other. It's about having fun. That's that's how that's how it started. That's how it needs to stay. Uh, we're going to do all we can to make you competitive. Uh, if, you know, if that's if that's something you're interested in, you know, we'll, we'll we'll help you out as much as we can. But until our next video with an actual painted custom controller, uh, this is Zach. And if you have any questions, please check us out. Lazamods.com. L-A-Z-A-M-O-D-Z dot C-O-M. Everyone have a nice day. We'll see you soon. Thank you.